Alright, anyway. Welcome back to another look back on we're doing a look back on Christmas, Bloody Christmas. And this film is actually fucking good. It's a good uh shutter film. I think that's what it's made by Shutter, I believe. I, I can barely remember the fucking name because I haven't watched it in a very long time, but it's a fucked up it's a fucked up kind of movie because at the very beginning he you th- you think it's a robot Santa. Well, he is a robot, so... At the beginning, you think it's a normal Santa Claus, uh... I don't know, wandering around in the fucking shop. And he kills this couple that was having sex. Which is... I don't know why every horror film has to have sex, but... And then he kills a kid at a house, I remember that. Then he ends up going back to the police station and fucking everything up. The girl has a final fight with him, and it's fucking intense. I mean intense. The robot will not die. And at the very end, he's still alive somehow, but she ends up killing him, and she survives. They should make a second one, because that will be pretty cool to see the return of Mr. Robot, or whatever the fuck you call him. Mr. Santa Claus Robot. I don't fucking know. But I like this movie a lot. A lot of people might have not liked it, but I liked it, in my opinion. I like movies like this. All weird and shit and fucking intense. That's what, that's me, I like intense movies, but. Um, yeah, I don't remember what I gave this movie, but if you want to look at it, it's in the thing. But, uh, yeah. That's basically about it. If you want to watch this movie, go watch it. Or if you want to watch a good movie, watch this one. If you like intense movies, like this kind of shit but yep that's about it see ya